Hello, boys and girls, I'm back. This book is called Wonderful Worms, and it's by Linda Glazer. Pictures by Loretta Kropinski. Hmm. Wonderful worm. Gross. Earthworms are fat and wiggly, like my fingers and toes. So I want everybody to try to wiggle your toes. Wiggle your fingers. They live where it is cool and dark and damp, where roots spread out like underground trees. So look there, there's a tree. And you can see the little earthworm has his own little trail. Worms feel sounds with their whole bodies. They feel thunder when I walk. So every time you walk, you feel it. Like if I hit my chair, I can feel that. That's kind of cool. So that's what an earthworm feels. They are wonderful diggers. They dig passageways and burrows, but they don't use shovels or fingers or toes. Oh, I got dirt on the bottom of my sock. Whoopsie. How do they do it? They eat their way through and move along. Ew, gross. They eat dirt. <laughs> I'm glad I'm not a worm. I don't think I could do it. They stretch out long and thin and squeeze in short and fat. So let's try that. We're gonna stretch out, let's stretch out long and thin and then go down short and fat. All right. They stretch and squeeze and stretch and squeeze and eat and dig and move and dig. Ooh, there's a snake. Look at that slithery snake. It's not the same though, because snakes don't eat dirt. Earthworms mix and turn the dirt as they dig and tunnel in the earth. They make the sand soft and airy so the roots of plants can breathe and grow. That's kind of, oh, oh look here. There's a salamander and a snail. Worms don't have eyes or ears or nose. They do have a mouth. Hmm. Look at that cute puppy. And they need food just like I do, but they eat dirt and rotting leaves. So they eat different stuff than we do, don't they? They swallow tiny pieces, and inside the worms, the food changes. Uh-oh. Do I really want to know? Probably not. When it comes out of their tail ends, that's their butt. It makes the earth rich so plants can grow. So basically, an earthworm eats the dirt that's there, and then they let it out their butt. And it makes everything real rich and it helps plants to grow, which is kind of cool. So earthworms help. Earthworms are my helpers, the underground gardeners. We work hard in the dirt in my garden, their home. Look at those big watermelons, yum oh. All right. And I'm not gonna read this, but in the back of the book, maybe I'll take a picture of it and add it, but in the back of the book, there are facts about wonderful worms. There's a whole page of it, which is really cool and it asks questions and tells you more about it. So that was Wonderful Worms. So the next book I'm gonna read is called Diary of a Worm. I hope you guys enjoy it. 